The James Webb Space Telescope launched in the orbit seven months ago and has currently scanned the depths of space. Webb primarily detects infrared wavelengths. Unlike one of the biggest space telescopes, the Hubble, it can look deeper into the universe than ever before by studying infrared light, which can pass through the dust clouds that cover newborn stars. Webb's first image has been released, and it shows galaxies that might date back more than 13 billion years, nearly as old as the universe. In this video, we'll present you with the 10 discoveries made by the James Webb Space Telescope. Make sure you stay tuned to the end of this video to know these discoveries. Before we begin, welcome to Discover Space. If you want to be a part of our space journey, don't forget to click the subscribe button and hit the notification bell next to it to be the first to know whenever we upload a new video. Number 10. First Compact Galaxy Group Ever Discovered Stevens Quartet is a visual grouping of five galaxies, of which four form the first compact galaxy group ever discovered. The group is located in the constellation Pegasus. The group is the most studied of all the compact galaxy groups. The first galaxies that make up Stevens Quartet collectively go by the name Hickson Compact Group 92. Only four of the so-called quartet of galaxies are actually close to one another and will most certainly merge. The fifth member is not actually a true member of the group and is in the foreground. In this image, red denotes the dusty, star-forming regions as well as extremely distant early galaxies and galaxies covered in thick dust. And blue denotes stars or star clusters without dust. Dust with diffuse blue regions contain a high concentration of big hydrocarbon molecules. The green and yellow colors reflect more distant, earlier galaxies that are also rich in these hydrocarbons and represent the minor background galaxies strewn throughout the sky. Number 9. The Not-So-Close Member NGC 720C is an unbarred spiral dwarf galaxy that is 39 million light-years from Earth in the northern constellation Pegasus. It is moving away from us at a speed of about 786 kilometers per hour. Despite the fact that NGC 7320 is a foreground galaxy, not a member of the galaxy group, which is located approximately 300 million light years away, it forms Stevens Quintet with the galaxies NGC 7317, NGC 7318A, NGC 7318B, and NGC 7319. This galaxy group is also known as Hickson Compact Group 92 and ARP 319. Extensive star forming regions are visible in NGC 7320 as red blobs, indicating active star formation. Young star clusters are the brilliant blue spots. NGC 7320 is closer to Earth than the other Stevens Quintet members. Number 8. Cartwheel Galaxy The Cartwheel Galaxy is a lenticular galaxy and ring galaxy about 500 million light years away in the constellation Sculptor. This galaxy formed as the result of a fast collision that occurred about 400 million years ago. The cartwheel is composed of two rings, a bright inner ring and a colorful outer ring. Both rings expand outward from the center of the collision like shock waves. Despite the impact, the huge spiral galaxy still retains a lot of its original characteristics, notably its rotating arms. The vivid red streaks seen between the inner and outer rings are the spokes that provide the cartwheel galaxy with its name. These brilliant red hues located not only throughout the cartwheel, but also the companion spiral galaxy at the top left are caused by glowing hydrocarbon-rich dust. The Cartwheel Galaxy is also home to a Type II supernova called SN2021 AFDX. Number 7. Quartet's Galaxy Pair NGC 7318A and NGC 7318B are two colliding galaxies about 280 million light years from Earth. They appear in the constellation Pegasus and are members of Stevens Quartet. A huge intergalactic shockwave is present in the pair shown by an arc produced by NGC 7318B colliding with the group. The shock wave from the collision of NGC 7318B and NGC 7318A heats the hydrogen atoms in the gas of the clusters, resulting in the green glow. This collision may help provide light on what happened roughly 10 billion years ago. Young, dazzling blue star clusters and pinkish clouds of blazing hydrogen where newborn stars are being born surround the galaxies. 
These stars have not yet thrown away their noctal clouds and are less than 10 million years old. And Rider Center is a region of intergalactic space where numerous star clusters are developing far from the galaxies. Number six, oldest galaxy. Glass C13 is a Lyman break galaxy discovered by the Grissom Lens Amplified Survey from Space Observing Program using the James Webb Space Telescope in July 2022. It was only 300 to 400 million years after the Big Bang when it was first detected, making it one of the oldest galaxies ever seen. According to estimates, it has a redshift about Z equal 13. It was discovered alongside another galaxy, Glass C11, a galaxy that is comparable to GNZ11 and is one of the oldest galaxies ever found. James Webb Space Telescope's NERCAM shows the image of Glass C13 as a red dot among the galaxies. Number 5. Quartet's Disturbed Galaxy NGC 7319 is a highly distorted barred spiral galaxy that is a member of the Compact Stevens Quartet group located in the constellation Pegasus, some 300 million light years distant from the Milky Way. The interaction with the other members of the quintet has greatly disturbed the galaxy's arm, dust, and gas. This galaxy has almost entirely lost its neutral hydrogen, most likely as a result of a collision with NGC 7320C some 100 million years ago. From NGC 7319, two lengthy parallel tidal tails extend in the direction of NGC 7320C and are currently undergoing star formation. A supermassive black hole, 24 million times the mass of the sun, is found in NGC 7319. It actively gathers material in emits light with 40 billion suns worth of energy. Number 4. New Giant Exoplanet WASP 96b is a gas giant exoplanet and larger than Jupiter. It is about 1,150 light years away from Earth and located in the constellation Phoenix. Whilst 96b spectrum is one of the first released images from the James Webb Space Telescope, the spectrum confirmed the existence of water and showed that the planet's atmosphere has clouds and hazes. Whilst 96b was assumed to be cloud-free before this discovery, Whilst 96b travels just one-ninth of the distance between Mercury and the Sun as it orbits its Sun-like star Wasp 96 every 3.5 Earth days, the transmission spectrum revealed previously unknown details of the atmosphere including the undeniable signature of water, indications of haze, and proof of clouds that were previously believed not to exist based on previous observations. The light curve release confers properties of the planet, including its existence, size, and orbit. Number 3. Areas of Star Birth The Carina Nebula is a massive, complex area of bright and dark nebulicity in the constellation Carina and is located in the Carina constellation. The nebula is approximately 8,500 light years away from Earth. In this image, you can see the edge of a nearby young star forming region, NGC 3324, in the Carina Nebula. This image reveals the previously hidden areas of star birth. The area, which is actually the border of a massive gaseous cavity within NGC 3324, is known as the Cosmic Cliffs. The cavernous area has been carved from the nebula by the intensive ultraviolet radiation and stellar winds from extremely massive, hot young stars located in the center of the bubble, above the area shown in this image. The high energy radiation from these stars is molding the nebula's walls by slowly eroding it away. Number two, Southern Ring Nebula. Southern Ring Nebula, also known as NGC 3132, is a bright planetary nebula in the constellation Vela it is located about 2,000 light years away from Earth. The bright star in NGC 3132 center supports the nebula's surrounding structure. The source of the nebula is a second star that is just barely visible at lower left along one of the big star's diffraction spikes. Over thousands of years, it has spewed at least eight layers of gas and dust. However, the bright center star visible here has caused turbulence that has altered the form of the incredibly complex rings in this planetary nebula. The pair of stars are locked in a tight orbit, which leads the dimmest star to expel ejected material in different directions as they orbit one another, resulting in this jagged ring. Number 1. Flood of Galaxies SMAX 0723 is a cluster of galaxies about 4 billion light-years from Earth. Within the southern constellation of Volans, in this image, 
thousands of galaxies are visible. This amazingly detailed image was made possible by gravitational lensing and high-resolution imagery from the James Webb Space Telescope. The bright white elliptical galaxy in the image's center, as well as other smaller white galaxies, made lensing possible. They are bending the light from galaxies that appear at the vast distances behind them because they are gravitationally bound together in a galaxy cluster. The combined mass of galaxies and dark matter function like a cosmic telescope, magnifying, twisting, and occasionally reflecting images of specific galaxies. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed, don't forget to like, also subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon to never miss a new video. Also, let us know your thoughts in the comments down below. Until next time.